before we get deep into the video, bro, bro, if you got a car channel on YouTube, if you, this is strictly, this kind of information right here, well, really not even car channel. If you doing anything like, bro, fuck it. Bro, you doing, if you doing anything that you feel like, that you, that you know illegal, bro, like anything, bro, don't do that shit. Don't record that shit, bro. Cause don't fold it watching, fam. Don't fold watch every move you make, every video you post. It's like, like that shit hard, bro. Like you gotta want to do this shit. Like you, that shit so hard. I had to get another job. I had to take a risk on another job. Stay down. I took a big ass pay cut. Like I, I was working at hundred. I was working at peak payment when I started. My, when I actually like started my YouTube. Like when I actually like made. Uh, first video, like, you know, you think one month you rocking out, thinking everything good, your views up, all that, your subscribers are going crazy, your views are going crazy, all that. Fuck going on, gang. Back with another video, man. Y'all already know who it is. A really YouTube live boy, Big underscore four. Today, topic of this video, I'm going to give y'all the pros and cons of becoming a YouTuber and what come with this shit and all that shit. Because everybody be DMing me. Like, my DM go crazy. No cap, my DM go crazy about, oh, bro, I want to become a YouTuber and do all that. So I'm finna tell y'all like what come with this shit and how this shit go in my way. I'm gonna show you the way, the way I know and the shit I know, the good advice that I can give y'all. I can't give y'all what nobody else can give y'all and shit. I'm just give you the advice that I know and what I done learned so far and what I still need to work on and all that shit. And comment down below, man, and what y'all wanna see next coming up on the channel too, bro. I need that, I need all that type of comments. All, all my subscribers who watch this video, everybody who tune in watch this video, comment down below. Uh, next things that I need to be doing Like on my videos and shit The next like ideas and shit like that So y'all just tap in man I hope y'all enjoyed the video bro Make sure y'all subscribe like hit that bell button bro We're going to the whole 2023 Yes sir All right. Another thing before we get deep into the video bro Bro if you got a car channel on YouTube If you this is strictly This kind of information right here Well really not even car channel If you doing anything like Bro fuck it Bro, you doing if you doing anything that you feel like that you that you know illegal, bro. Like anything, bro. Don't do that shit. Don't record that shit, bro. Cause don't fold it watching, fam. Don't fold watch every move you make, every video you post. They watch your Instagram. They watch your Facebook. All that shit. But really, man, this this for car YouTube because they they what I they what I've been doing. I've been doing this since I started YouTube car car content. So all the car content YouTubers, bro, be careful what you post. Be careful how you move in them cars, bro, because them folks are watching. Them folks on your ass. You will be thinking, just because your channel ain't big yet or anything like that, they ain't watching. Shit, that's some shit happen, and you record it. Well, them folks on your ass, bro. I'm talking about them, though, like, it's your dough. Like, it's your job. Them folks going to come to your job, all type of shit, bro. Like, they treat you, they treat this shit like, like people are, like, killing someone. So, if you're doing car content on YouTube, I advise you to go on, switch it up, do some other shit. You can still do car content. I'm still going to do my car content. It just don't do no content near the area you live or an area you feel like that you feel like that it ain't good. Just do all legit shit. All everything legit, do it. All the legal events, all, I mean, all them legal events and takeovers and all that shit, stop that shit, bro. Do not record none of that shit. Don't even go to that bit because them folks on your ass, like, you ain't even got to be recording. Just getting caught out there. Them folks on your ass, bro. No cap, bro. So if you doing car content on YouTube, I repeat again, be careful what you do in them cars, bro. Like far as the burnouts, racing, goddamn shit. Shit, hell. I even say hell, recording. Recording, goddamn looking at the camera, hell. Cause they might say some shit by that. You never know. <laughs> they might say, but I don't. I don't know, bro. I don't trust that shit, bro. Them boy, hell, bro. Like, 12 is watching, so make sure y'all be careful what y'all doing. Make sure you ain't got them mimicking them folks and, like, like saying nothing bad, like saying fuck 12 and all that shit. Like, don't say shit like that, because, like, if you get caught or anything like that, they can use that against you in court. They use all that shit against you, so they be careful what y'all post if you're doing car content. I say at least by goddamn... I say at least by goddamn about... To me, I post it. I be posting every time I drop a video. I post at five o'clock, cause that's like when I, my audience, like, it like for some reason, them with my audience, like, watch my shit the most, like, like around that time, like, then it, it just it keep going. But I'm saying like that when they lock in for that. I done tried different times and 
I did it early in the morning. That shit didn't work. But really, it go off for you how you whatever content you doing. So you just gotta look at your go to your YouTube studio and look at your algorithm and see what times that your fans that you're gaining at that moment. Like see what time they be on YouTube. Cause it gonna show you. So that's that's what I can say for far as like uh, when to post a video and shit on YouTube and shit. So you just gotta look at that and just really just all about your algorithm. You gotta look at your algorithm. Really like it, your algorithm is your audience basically. So shit, you just gotta got them. Um, it really go off of you whatever content you do. See, I was doing like some shit like the content I do is like made like on some shit like it's like my fans know that shit. It's like. It's like on some weekend type shit, like what you would do on the weekend. Basically, like that's how my content is, shit like that. But I post at five o'clock. I don't know about if how nobody else do, but that's when my audience watching me the most. Like, all right, everything after five o'clock, that when they watching me. If you doing YouTube from your phone, if you anybody, you can start on you can start on the phone, bro. Like, you can you can just do it off a regular phone, fam. Like, you ain't gotta have no. Big ass camera and all that shit. Hell nah, them folk be man, that shit weak. You can, you can get that shit now. I ain't even saying don't get it, but it, reason why I'm saying it weak. Cause nigga, some folk be trying to shit on you about that shit. Hell nah, boy. You 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 can start off your phone, bro. So everybody be talking about, oh, get a camera and all that shit, bro. Just hold your phone sideways, bro. Like just hold your phone like this and record. That's all you gotta do. Hold your phone sideways. That's a big way. That's how I started holding my phone sideways. And then the most space on the video too. Um, shit, I say shit, bruh, like, don't think like, like when you, when you just starting off, don't think, don't think like, don't think like, damn, I can't do this. Like, if you really want to do this, you gotta like, you gotta really put time and hard work in this shit. Like, this shit is like a job. You gotta treat it like, like you wanna do it. Like, an actual job. That's how you gotta treat this shit. That's how I do. I treat it like a, a real job. Like I got a job too, but I treat it like like this another job that I'm going to. Like when I get out work, I think I treat this as another job. So you gotta treat it like that. And then like shit, don't think all your subscribers are gonna watch all your videos because it don't be like that all the time. Sometimes you gonna have, you might have somebody subscribe to you, and they'll never watch you again. Like it be like that. Like it, it'll be some shit like that. Or you you might have somebody. They view your video, they'll never watch you again. Shit like that. Or they might watch a couple videos. They might skip videos. Don't expect all your subscribers to watch all your video. And don't get stuck on one video. Like, say if a video, like, go viral. Like, I had a video that hit a meal. Like, just saying, for example. Don't, don't, like, dwell on that video to make you successful. Like, just keep going. Like, once you're done with the video, once it's uploaded, and it probably, I say about a, about a week go by, your, your shit like it's it, it it's a chance that it can fuck around and go viral again, but it's also a chance that it's gonna stay right there. What where is it? Until somebody watch that shit. Like when you first drop on YouTube, when you first drop your video, you gonna you most likely gonna get the most views right then. Like you gonna get all your views right then in them couple of, couple of days. Like between one to to four days. Like you gonna still, you still might get a little buzz out that video, but after that, it really gonna be it. Shit, really just got down, bro. You just gotta keep going, bro. Like you will feel like, like damn, bro. Like you might, you might do like how YouTube work. Like it, 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 it'll blow you now. You will got down. You will think one month you rocking out, thinking everything good. Your views up, all that. Your subscribers are going crazy. Your views are going crazy, all that. Like people. People might be saying something to you about your video when you be out in public, all that type shit. Then in that month, that shit, yeah. Go down. Like, you'll, you'll, you'll watch everything go down from your pay to all that. So, like, you got to got now. It be ups and downs with the YouTube shit. So, don't think, like, once you, like, go up, you can't go back down. And also, don't think, don't think like, once you get so far up and shit, like, you, you big and shit, like, you big and better than everybody, like, type shit. Like, that shit right there ain't gonna get you nowhere. Like, train your subscribers a certain way and shit like that. That shit ain't gonna get you nowhere. You gotta really be tapped in with them folks. Like, for real. Like, them folks, them folks taking their time out to watch you. So, that how you gotta treat that shit out. That how I do. Like, every subscriber, they done to know, like, if I ain't get a chance to reach out to them, I I try my best to, like, reach back. Then every Everybody who ever in contact with me, they'll tell you. Everybody. 
Hell no. <laughs> Hell no, boy. That shit have had you about the wig, boy. That shit have had you about the wig. That didn't look like back to the last, last um, question I, that it just asked. It's like, like, that shit hard, bro. Like, you gotta wanna do this shit. Like, you really gotta wake up. Like, it'll be some time you'll wake up. You'll wake up and be like, damn, bro. Like, bro, I ain't even need no point of doing this shit. But then, like, when you just, you just gotta keep going. You gotta go past that shit. But really, you two, like, it really, like, if you ain't got no team or nothing, like, this shit, like, self-motivation. Even if you got a team, it's still self-motivation because it's your dream. It ain't nobody else's dream around you, so you got to look, look at it like that. But far, like, like just being one, like, it's fun. Like, it be it be fun. Like, I love, like, being out of public, see my supporters and stuff. Like, that give me more motivation to go harder and stuff like that. Yeah, hell yeah. Love, love the YouTube shit. I ain't going to count. Like, this shit, like... Like, this shit is a big reason I got, most of the reason that I got everything that we got now, like, no cap. Like, without YouTube, like, I wouldn't probably have none of this. Like, I wouldn't have my car, none of that. Like, everything I wanted, I probably wouldn't have it before I started YouTube. Because I, before I started YouTube, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even type of mindset of, like, trying to, like, invest in stuff, getting money, like, like, saving, all that type of shit. Like, you know what I'm saying, Jay? Just building, building your brand. Now, really, I always want to do a YouTube. I always want to be a YouTube, but really, like, watching, like, Life of Core, CJ on 32, watching all them boys, like, like, damn, like, them boys, like, 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 them boys did it. Like, I seen, I seen them boys start from scratch, like, well, I've been watching Core since he started his channel. So, they, like, just to see where Bray at now, like, Bray down there, like, touching a meal subscriber, like, that's crazy. That's some hard shit to do, bro. Like, off recording itself. He ain't doing nothing crazy. That man just being himself, being smooth. Like, watching them boy, like, that shit motivation. That shit made me want to go harder and shit. But that what made me want to become a YouTuber, like, watching them. And I always wanted to be a YouTuber. Like, I always wanted to be like, but I know I can do this shit. Like, you just got to look look at this shit and just be like, can you see yourself doing this shit? But at the beginning, you ain't going to think you can do it. You just going to be really just trying some shit until you find yourself. Really, you gotta find yourself for real. I was got I was about to do YouTube when I had my perfect bit. Everybody know. Um, you can go back to my old videos and see that video. Um, when I had my perfect bit, my ex, she wrecked my shit. So I was like, damn, I'm gonna make a video out of this shit. I made a video. That bit hit 2K. That bit hit 2K. I was like, oh shit. So my mama was like, you wanna do it? You should do it. I think you should do it. If you drop another video and then get some good number, I drop a net video. That be hit. That be hit like fifteen hundred, like in two days. I thought I was doing some shit, so I was like, shit. I'm gonna just keep trying that shit. Just keep trying that shit. So I just kept posting, kept posting. That shit so hard. I had to get another job. I had to take a risk on another job. Stay down. I took a big ass pay cut. Like I, I was working at hundred. I was working at Pete Payment when I started, my, when I actually, like, started my YouTube. Like, when I actually, like, made a first video, like, it wasn't even a video. It was, like, it was, like, the video, like, 10 seconds. It was just, like, a little small little video. But that's the day I, that's the day I told myself when I was at Pete. I was like, bro, I'm, I'm going to start, I'm going to start my YouTube. So, I prolonged for it. I chilled. I didn't do nothing. After that video, I probably did, like, three more videos after that. Like, little shorts, like, little short slight videos. But I did that, and then I waited. I had got another job, another job, and got down, um, a job called MDV. They store, like, all the goddamn groceries and shit for the military and shit like that. Like, everything that's on Post, everything that's in Walmart, goddamn family dollars, all that shit. They store all that shit, like, soldiers, the chips, everything, everything, tissue, toothpaste, all that. But, yeah. But they, they store all that shit though. And then when I was working there, I started, I did, I did a long video. I did a long video. It was like probably like about 15 minutes. It was my boy Solo. That when he first got his charger and we were talking about like the mods and all that shit that he was gonna do to it and shit like that. Then I ended up got now leaving that job and started working at Hyundai Globus. And when I did that, that was the best decision I did because that job like like, it work around my schedule where I can do YouTube and still work. So, I still punch the clock. So, don't think, like, 
Don't think that this shit impossible, bro. Cause it, it, it's, it's possible, bro. On my mama, bro. If I can do it, bro, I know people can do it, bro. Cause I know it people who have way more free time than I do, bro. And if I can do it, do all the shit I have to do, I know you can do it. Real shit. It, it hard, now, Cause, like, you might have some shit coming up, like, family type shit. Then you'll be like, damn, like, I want to do this so bad, but I want to do this so bad. So it really on some shit, like, it go off of you and what you got going on. You got to just think about this shit, like, like, if you, like, say, like, you have, like, I just had a, some deaths in the family, like, some shit like that. Like, you got to learn how to, like, you got to make, you really, like, when you start off, you got to make a schedule, like, how you going to, you got to try to do a schedule on how you going to do shit. Like, that's what I did. I, t I did a schedule, like, okay, all right, so. I work Monday through Friday. Then when I get off Friday, from Friday to Sunday, I'm making content. That's how I started off doing it. See, now it's more different. It's more like on some shit. Like, it's still the same. It's still kind of the same way, but it's more easier now because, like, like I can make a video, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm doing right now, I can make a video. And it's, today is Friday. Like, it's the beginning of Friday, but it's still considered, like, my, one of my weekdays. And shit that that I don't make content, but you just you just gotta know how to. It really all for you, bro. You gotta know how to deal with this shit. You gotta know how to like move around that shit. But that shit, that shit, very hard, especially like if you have shit like different family or you still gotta work. You know what I'm saying? You still got a job that you probably gotta. You probably be on third shift at a job or some shit like that. That shit hard. That shit hard. But luckily for the grace of God, thank God that my job is on first shift. And so, by the time I get off, I still have some time to make some content and do what I do and shit without being tired. So, it, it's just all for, like, however you cope with your shit and how how you got down, can work through your shit, for real. Shit, really just on some shit, like, really just motivating people, like, for real, like, you can do this shit. Like, if I know if I can do it, if I can pick up a camera and just start recording and do what I do now and made it this far, I know you can do it. So that's my motivation. You need a thousand subscribers and four thousand hours with the watch time, and you gotta make sure you ain't got no copyrights. You gotta make sure the copyrights is like you can't play like no rappers, like no big music, like Lil Baby, Young Dolph, all that type of shit. Anybody who big, like sign, you can't play this shit um, past eight seconds, or you gonna get copyrighted. And whatever you make all that video, it gonna go to them. So just imagine that shit. Imagine you get a video, you get copyrighted, that big old viral. Ooh, but you got it, boy. But them folk, but them folk gonna see your pocket, boy. Folk gonna see your pockets, no cap. So just make sure that you do all that, and make sure you stay on top of like you just follow the rules, like through YouTube, cause YouTube that got strict over it. since I started. YouTube that got strict, like for like, cause it's a lot, it's a lot more kids on on social media and stuff now, so they more hip to it. So the, the algorithm and stuff, how it's all set up and stuff. If you if you posting like some stuff like wild content, like some that's like endangering people, like most likely it gonna get yellow mark. Most likely it gonna get yellow mark, and you don't want you don't want yellow mark, cause yellow mark can then uh, cause you to lose your channel. Yeah, yeah. If you don't want none of your video to get yellow mark. Now some videos you might do, it might be something that you ain't really do for real. Sometimes you ain't gonna be able to help that. It just somehow how the algorithm work. So. Just make sure you just make sure all your videos had a green check instead of the yellow mark. Cause you get a yellow mark, you get so many of them. That, like I say, you can lose your channel. Uh, you can get suspended. You can do all that. Like all that can happen. Your thumbnails and your titles is the most important thing at the beginning of your video. Like the first in your first your first twenty seconds. I say your first twenty seconds of your video. Make sure like you on point. Make sure you doing something like. And you ain't gotta be doing that, but just make sure you, you like, you giving them the reason of why they clicked on your video. Like, you gotta do that. Like, that will gonna help you get far. That will gonna help you get reach your algorithm. And make sure you just tell them folks subscribe and like. For real, shit. I drop. I got a rhythm. See, I work my way. I work my way down. Like when I first started YouTube, I was doing it, doing it like once a week. But you gotta like, you gotta go off your. So, like, go off yourself first at the beginning until you find your rhythm. But now, I'm currently dropping every three days. Like, I don't go past really, I don't really don't go past four days without dropping a video. 
So that's something that you got to do to help you stay consistent. So the next next goal is going down to 2K, uh, two days. But I'm gonna go to um, I'm gonna go to one, I'm gonna go to every day. Like once I go full time, go full fledged on YouTube, I'm gonna try to drop every day, every day. <laughs> You know, you got to find your confidence. Find your confidence and just be yourself. Like, find, like, who you are. Like, like be yourself on that bit. Like, don't go in there trying to be like another YouTuber or anybody. Like, do you. Do what you know that you can do. Do do know what you what you capable of. Don't live above your means. Like, don't live above your means. Don't try to, like, soon as you, soon the first day, soon as you get your channel, you you go soon. You think about starting YouTube. You go get a Hellcat or some shit like that. Knowing you can't pay for that motherfucker, like don't do nothing like that. Cause then that shit gon' come back on you. Cause like everybody, like everybody, not gonna make it in YouTube. You just gotta go. To, you just gotta know what you know. You just gotta go with how you will. Like if you really want it, if you really want it, you can do it. Like if you really want to do this shit, you can do it. But it take time. Don't be expecting like like everybody to watch your channel. Don't be expecting your city to fuck with you at first. They it gonna take some time. Like people not gonna, they not gonna tap in at first. So you gotta just go off of that and don't try to do it like for the money. Don't don't start out doing it for the money. Cause you do, then you gonna you gonna lose your audience fast. Cause they gonna be able to tell it. They gonna be able to tell it like if you're doing it like if you're doing it cause you love this or you're doing it cause like you just want some money. Like nah, don't expect that. Cause at the beginning you ain't gonna get no good money anyway. Your first video, your first like, say your first ten video, like don't expect like no, no major major views. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Just try to get better at the every video that you do. I right, hope y'all enjoyed the video. That's my pros and the cons about being a YouTuber. Told y'all everything that I know. Everything. I hope everything work out. Like if you try to do a YouTube, just be careful of how you post your content, especially if you're doing car content. Yeah. Make sure you on point. Make sure you ain't doing no burnouts. Make sure you're doing everything legit, bro. Because I'm for ill watching, like I said. So, hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Make sure y'all subscribe, like, hit that bell button, bro. We're going to the whole 10 to the 3. Yes, sir.